Last time on the Iron Mammal Progress series, I did some solo raids and got a duplicate Ancestral Top. Then, after the Wilderness update came out, I did some Revenants and I got the 16 mil Relic, followed by my first Wilderness weapon being the Crossbow. Okay, Th what? I literally was letting this one sit for the purpose of the clip, and I got I got another one. Dude, look at my inventory. I just did a task of 120 moss giants, and I got eight mossy keys. They are a one out of 50 drop rate in the wilderness. That means I should have had to kill 400, but I killed like 120. I killed 128 for eight fucking keys. If you are unaware, Briofita's essence is used to make Briofita's staff, I think it's called. And that is the only master clue step that I cannot do. It's the only one in the entire game. That being said, I just haven't bothered to like fully commit to trying to get it yet. Because it doesn't, you know, it's not a problem very often. Uh, the essence is 1 out of 118, which isn't like that rare. But you definitely do hear horror stories of people going super dry. Belladonna seed? There's no way you just dropped me 17 GP. That what? Why is that a drop? The Belladonna seed is 1 out of 1.1k. That is 10 times as rare as the essence. Like, you're trolling. Alright, last one. It's kind of cool the amount of keys I got put me at a perfect 50 kill count. Okay, well, I... <laughs> I mean, it, okay, I get to do another kill now. I guess that's not bad. <laughs> Baited the shit out of me, though. Come on, Essence. Did Again! Hello! <laughs> what, what is this? <laughs> another one. <laughs> okay, actually the last one, maybe? Bro, how many times are we gonna do this? What the hell? <laughs> what the hell is this? How many in a row was that? Three? Surely not a fourth. Okay, yeah, <laughs> it had to stop eventually. That's pretty crazy, though. Well, as you guys saw in the intro, I did get a crossbow, which is going to be really huge to use for, well, the rest of the wilderness content. I'm going to continue doing more revenants to try to get the Vigora's Chain Mace, and then obviously I want to start doing the uh, the new versions of Vedion, Venonatus, and uh, Callisto. So, first things first, though, I didn't actually finish my revenants task yet, the one that I got the bow on, so let's give this thing a whirl. Here we go! Let's put this thing in action! Let's see what we can do. Zoe's excited. I literally just hit my max hit on the first attack. Holy fuck. Instantly hit my max hit, bruh. <laughs> it's a good crossbow. I got a lucky one. Uh, I got a good one. Oh, baby. I love it, dude. I love it. Okay. Look all the fucking luck, man. We get the crossbow and then Crystillia says, yeah, you can have more revenants. Okay. All right. And that is the first Revenant task completed with the new crossbow. I cannot believe that I did not get the mace on the next task. Honestly, never lucky, dude. Hey, 94 bears. Okay, that's awesome because the crossbow is supposed to be very good at Callisto. So let's go give it a whirl. We are on task with the crossbow. Let's see the damage. Should be good. Oh, there it is. 44, 48, 20, 46, 28. <laughs> Before I was killing with with a uh, with a bofa, which was okay, but this is uh, definitely a lot better. You know, unfortunately, I can't actually use. Oh my god. I'm gonna die to that. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking Callisto is the worst one to fight while getting PK'd. Because he hits so hard, man. 
Bro, oh my god, that painted me so bad. I saw the orange beam. Oh, well, I better go bank that. I, that actually might affect what I'm protecting on. Yep, I'm risking my Slayer Helm. I better bank. I mean, that's always cool. You know, always good to see. I saw the orange beam, got excited, but then didn't see the collection log and went, well, you know. But, eh, we take a dragon pickaxe at 44 kill count. Oh my. Oh my. <laughs> Not even a loot beam because it's depressingly cheap, but there is a, uh, a tyrannical ring at 76 kill count. Uh, oh my god. I saw a white dot. I was like, no, my ring I just got. <laughs> yeah, that's obviously not needed. I do have a tyrannical ring, but, uh, pretty good luck here so far. I gotta say, damn. Alrighty, this is going to be my last bear kill on task. We killed 94 Ardeo. I got the dragon pickaxe, got the tyrannical ring. Not the stuff I wanted, but I mean, that was pretty good, honestly. Oh, baby. Straight after the spiders, we got 72 revenants. Mwah! Thank you. Oh, yes! We were just talking about this thing earlier today. Yes, dude. Okay, so the Amulet of Avarice is... Effectively, like a salve and a glory combined, stats-wise, right? So it's got the the you know extra damage against revenants that the uh, the salve does, but it has the same stats that an amulet of glory does, whereas the salve has none. On top of that, though, the avarice also, if you get unnoted items like um, you can get like unnoted adamant bars, um, they will be automatically noted. And, I'm not done, and the Avarice will make you Scald all the time. So previously, I'd have to go, like, you know, get a Skull from somebody or whatever. But now, if I wear this, I'm always Skulled. So, nice, dude. If I die, I am gonna lose it, which I'm kind of mentally prepared might happen. But, I'm happy, man. I'm happy about an Avarice. Let's go. Yeah, see, look at that. Okay, so right there, the Dragon Long Swords would normally be unnoted, but because of the Avarice... Let's go. That's so nice. So before when I was killing the Revenant Knight by safe spotting it, using a rune crossbow, I really wasn't risking much, and so if somebody got on me, I would just, you know, leave the cave, run south, hope for the best. Well, now that I have the crossbow and I'm going to be risking the avarice, I would like to leave it a little bit less up to RNG, and instead of just trying to run away, the strat that I'm going to use now is I am going to try to freeze them and then log out. So I'm going to bring a Mystic Switch. And, um, you know, as long as you make sure that you yourself are unfrozen. So what I do is I keep an eye on... Above my inventory, I can see, like, the Freeze Timer or the Entangle Timer. I make sure that it's about to run out. And then I go for the Freeze. And as long as I catch it, I can go around the Stalagmite. And then I can log out. Uh, it's... You know, I would say it's going to be more consistent than running away and hoping for the best. But, you know, obviously it can still be dangerous if I don't catch the freeze when I need to. Well, we got 92 kills. The bracelet went off quite a bit. And uh, it's always the next one, right? Okay, 69 very nice skeletons. Let's go visit our pal, Vedion. Nah! Nah! D okay. <laughs> Give me that. Listen. If you have watched my channel for a long time, you would know that the first... <laughs> I... My Vedion kill count, I don't even remember what it is. It's in like the 2000s or something. It took me so fucking long to get a Ring of the Gods. And now, now I'm gonna go kill Calvarion 23 times and get one. Fuck off, man. <laughs> It's crazy, it's 14 mil though, so I mean, you know, that's cool, I guess. And that's the last kill of the skeleton task. 
Well, I'll take a ring of the gods, I guess. <laughs> that's, that's kind of funny to see. 76 bears off to Mr. Callisto. <laughs> well, there's the bear task completed. We got another 76 already o kills. Did not get anything on that one except for uh, lots of death. So next up, I got a spider task, and this PKer got on me, and he doesn't have barrage. He doesn't have TB. He does have venge though, which. Uh, to be honest, you could almost consider that ragging. I'm not gonna lie. I feel like if a PKer doesn't TB you, it's almost like ragging in a way because like you could just tell you at any given time, right? Now, of course, I'm stubborn, so I'm like, oh, I'm gonna fight him back. Um, and you know, we we sit here and we trade bolts for a while, and he ends up teleporting away. Um, so then I carry on, you know, fighting my spider, you know, because hey, I made him tell you I'm gonna keep killing my spider, and then eventually he comes back again. Oh, so boring. Why? You want the boss for yourself? Yeah, I don't think so, bro. Yeah. Take my fucking boss back, thank you. I can't lie, I kind of felt guilty, like, the rest of the day for saying bye when I killed that guy. I should have just said good fight. I, I don't know, bro, I just, I felt, I felt like a dick for saying bye. But anyway, so I get the kill, right? And, uh, of course, I, I do have loot keys turned on. Now, the reason I have loot keys turned on is, you know, as an Iron Man, I can't open them. But, what I can do is I can have my main kill me, and then he'll get the loot key, and then I can open that. We're back on the main now. I've got two loot keys. One of them will obviously be nothing, but let's see what I got from the PKer. 2.5 mil. Ooh. I don't know what the 600k is from. I have no idea. But we'll take the dragon crossbow. Hey, that's not obviously what I wanted, but that is an item that will always look cool, especially with the blue, like, web floor. Very contrasting. Let's go. Surely every world can't be taken. There's no way. Oh! Framed? And there is yet another spindle task completed. We are up to 215 kill count with absolutely dick butt kiss to show for it. Of all the new wilderness bosses, fighting back against PKers inside of the RTO or Callisto room is without a doubt the most interesting. If you miss one protect from mage and RTO decides to mage you, you're probably gonna get hit for a 50 and you're probably gonna die. On top of that though, if he's in melee distance, I mean, he just slaps you up. So you gotta, you gotta try to, you know, I don't know, protect yourself against the bear and the PKer, and uh, it can be an absolute clusterfuck. For some reason, though, I'm really, really stubborn, and I just refuse to telly if I think I can kill the guy. Which a lot of times, you'd be surprised, man. If you're unaware, um, if you're not killing like revenants and stuff like that, just normally speaking, the ma the the crossbow, excuse me. The crossbow is effectively a magic shortbow imbued with a range strength bonus equivalent to dragon arrows. So it's really not bad. It's it's pretty strong. Like you could you could be surprised. You can get some kills. Okay, okay, okay. So RTO apparently is being pretty nice to me in regards to the pickaxes. I think I'm gonna go bank that right away. That's my second RTO pick uh, dragon pickaxe in 237 kills. So, I mean, I'm getting D-picks here. I got the Ring of the Gods at uh, Vedion. Uh, Spindle's just... Sp Spindle doesn't like me, clearly, but... Uh, damn, I'm surprised, man. Still no weapon upgrades or anything from any of the bosses. I reckon. Uh, you motherfucker. You are fast. 
Hey, when did my wife start playing RuneScape? I didn't know her account was so good. Hey, 42 revenants. That is, again, a very low roll, but I'll take it. Peace. <laughs> that is so satisfying to do, bro. I fucking love that strat. It feels so good. Ooh, hello, a little money for your boy. Uh, unfortunately, it is one that I've had before, so... No collection log pop-up, but I mean, hey, it's a, it'll take one mil, why not? You know, I'm already sculled as it is. Do I just hop to 318 and try to find the dude quick? Hey, that's about the fastest I think I've ever found him. I will take my one mil, I'm sure I'll use that on... I don't know, what do I buy these days? <laughs> I have no idea. There's just no way we go two tasks in a row with absolutely... Well, I did get the totem, didn't I? Oh, yeah. Well, it would appear we do. If you're curious, I, I haven't shown the loot in a while, so I am gonna slap my loot on the screen so far. We're at 772 Revenant Knights. I gotta say, that's a... <laughs> that's a pretty drop log right there. I like the look of that. Oh! Oh! Keyception. That's cool. Mossy key and Laren's key on the same one. Give me your chest. I'm opening them. No. Don't do more. Thank you. <gasps> yes! The spin! It was the spin! Yes, dude! <laughs> Pre-open his essence on 68 kill count. Oh. Let's fucking go, dude. I can I can technically now do every single master clue, I think. Unless I'm forgetting one, but oh, dude. The spin as the loot appeared, that was the key. Hey, speaking of keys, I do have one left. Any back-to-backs? Yeah, I think this is it. I think you just use Briofita's essence on a battle staff. Hey, and there it is. Brio Fitta's staff. Now, it says uncharged. I believe you charge it with nature runes, I want to say. Yeah, there we go. Ah, that looks nice, dude. It's, you know, it's simple, humble, but it looks kind of nice. That's, that's awesome, dude. It's one of those things, again, that obviously it didn't come up super often. But if I ever get that master clue now, I'm finally able to do it. Thank God. And on that note, I'm going to go ahead and call it a video. Thank you all very much for watching. I am still loving this wilderness content so much. I'm having a lot of fun, and I'm just going to carry on, man. I'm going to keep on hunting for revenants tasks, and I mean, surely we're bound to start getting some of the new items from the new bosses soon, right? Surely. Uh, if you guys did enjoy today's video, feel free to leave a like, and I will see you all soon.